everybody, this is Mrs. D'Alessio, and today I'm going to teach you how to make a simple audio podcast using GarageBand. So first, you may or may not already have GarageBand on your desktop, but if you don't, you can go into the Finder and go into your Applications, and then you're going to go look through your applications until you find the one that has the little guitar on it and that's the one. You can then double click on it or you can drag it onto your little toolbar. In this case I'm just going to double click on GarageBand and then it will open up a new project. I'm going to select the button that says Voice and then I can do Choose. Now I haven't chosen a name for it so I'm going to call it maybe First podcast and then I also suggest putting your name by and then putting your name now don't word, write the word name write your own name and then for the time being we're going to save it right on the desktop and then later on from there we can put it on the server we could upload it into our Google Docs or we could save it on a flash drive or do whatever it is that you want with it. So now I'm not going to worry about what's down here. I'm not doing music. I'm just going to press the word create. I will take just a little minute and up here it doesn't really matter whether you're male or female. And then over here you see the browse tab and the edit tab. We're not going to do messing around with any special effects on this simple project, but one thing you might want to do is make sure that all of these buttons are unchecked, otherwise you're going to get some funny sound effects that make it sound echoey, which might be fun for something else, but not for today. Today we're just going to keep it real simple. And you also want to make sure that you have your input source selected. Since we're going to be using a blue snowball, you could select that, but you can also choose an internal microphone if you don't have one, and that's going to be fine too. Now if you notice over here, I have a little timeline, and this little red line is going to show me where in the timeline I'm going to be. To record, all I need to do is press this red button on the bottom, and it's recording my voice right now. And where you're speaking, you can see those little lines kind of jump up and down where there's sound. When you're quiet, the line goes a little bit flat. When you're finished, you can just press that record button again and you're done. The red line keeps going, but if I press the space bar on my computer, it will stop. And down here, I can rewind it. Or I can rewind it with this button all the way to the beginning. To play it again, I can either press the play button to hear it back, or you can press the space bar. So that's my playback. Now, you can listen to it, see if it sounds okay. If you don't like it, you can always record over. But for this project, we're not really worried about fine details. We're just practicing our reading and our voice and trying to finish this project. Now when I'm finished, I'm going to look up here in my GarageBand toolbar and I'm going to press the Share button. Now down here I'm going to select Export Song to Disk. Now over here, I don't need a really fancy quality because I'm not doing anything fancy with music, just my voice. I can just press Good Quality and you can either choose MP3 or the other one. We're going to choose MP3 encoder for today. And then when you're finished, you're going to press export. For for right now, I want to save my podcast on my desktop. And then later on, we'll do other things for it. But right now, it'll make it really easy to find when we're finished. And I press save. It will take just a minute. And for our first project, we're going to keep it real small. And now maybe I want to go check to see if it exported out fine. So I'm going to go here and I'm going to hide GarageBand just for a minute. And I can see my project over here. This is my original GarageBand project and here's my final recording. If you just press the play button you can hear it. On the bottom. And it's recording my voice right now. When you are finished you can go save it in wherever it is that you're going to save it. And if you're sure 
that you don't want to re-record and you're done, you can now trash this project by clicking and dragging it and throwing it into the trash can. Congratulations, you have just finished your first podcast and you can quit GarageBand. Have fun!